Now, the retired British businessman Christopher Tappan will be landing in Texas later this evening in the custody of two U.S. Marshals. The 65-year-old was extradited to America without the opportunity to make any case in his own defense under a controversial U.S.-U.K. extradition deal. He said the terms of the treaty, described by his lawyer as inhumane, meant that he had fewer rights than if he were a terrorist. This is disgraceful, and yet another example of just how hypocritical governments are. This man is being extradited for selling batteries to Iranians. Why is Cameron not being extradited for his part in the murder of over 30,000 innocent Libyans, for funding, arming, training and supporting Al-Qaeda to rise up and murder Tony Blair's best friend, Colonel Gaddafi. Despite reality, the mainstream media still keep hyping the threat from Iran and Al-Qaeda. Billions of dollars of Al-Qaeda support later, the TSA are still groping children in the name of saving us from Al-Qaeda. And with Iran, it's weapons of mass destruction all over again or weapons of mass disappearance all over again. Are you going to be a chump again and allow over one million innocent people to die in Iran, just like in Iraq? Or are you going to make the effort to find out the truth? I know it's a dirty word, but try looking for it every now and then.